All right, yeah, this is Columns 2. Um, I used to play Columns... Yes, 2. Uh, okay, so for one thing, I'm on the right and James is on the left. So, I, I've i actually... I'm not familiar with any of the Columns games. So this is a, a little bit different. I guess it's, it's similar to um, Tetris or Dr. Mario, but it's right. more about matching up the colors yeah and i'm still yeah. learning what the patterns are it seems like you can do you know not only can you do diagonal but you can kind of do them in these like patterns like an x shape or a cross you know but when i first played this i was a little bit frustrated that you can't turn these uh you get this column of three you know jewels or whatever they are you can't turn it uh horizontally but i guess that is the name of the game that it's a column did you ever used to play any video games with your parents at all the only video games i ever remember playing with a parent was with my dad uh top gun nes <laughs> and and golf nes those were the only two games he ever played that i can remember so this is one of the very few games that i play with my mom Okay. And we used to play this like endlessly because she likes these kind of games, you know, like the Bejeweled and like all that kind of stuff. So um, it, it's always funny like playing it, playing a game like with a parent. But um, Columns was actually one of the first games I had when I got a Sega Genesis. I'm pretty nostalgic for Columns. But now this is Columns too. I didn't have Columns too. I had the original Columns. That's really cool that they made it online. Uh you know, so that we could do this. So, um, okay, so I got that one. Yeah. Yeah, so for me, I actually, I heard of Columns back then. Columns is like one of the major Genesis games that comes up because it's sort of like, you know, Nintendo has Tetris and Sega has Columns. Like, But because I had Tetris and I played a lot of Dr. Mario especially. Yeah. I played a lot of Yoshi. I feel like I got my fix of puzzle games on the Nintendo consoles where I just never felt the need to play Columns. Because there's plenty, but, plenty of them to play on the NES. So I'm glad that I'm finally getting around to playing it. What's great is that you and I are playing this like together online. This is the type of game you want to play with another person and, and like do exactly what we're doing here. Um, yeah. Like, you know, ver versus somebody else. It, it, it's, it's fun, I guess, to play but you know, on your own too, but um, I always enjoyed playing this versus another person more. You know what? I'm doing surprisingly well right now. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing some very bad, so. <laughs> <laughs> oh, maybe maybe not anymore. I just finally am getting some stuff right now. I, I just, I kind of pulled it together. Oh, now I'm fucked. Right after I said it, I knew it was going to happen, too. <laughs> I, yeah, I, I was about to oh, die. Oh, fuck! Boom. Oh, what just, wait a minute, did we both lose? No, I won. Once you get up to, like, the top three rows, where you can just fit one column in, it doesn't really like once you get up there, you're you're fucked. I don't really have much of a strategy. I tend to do better when I'm not thinking too hard about it in this game. Getting intense. Oh yeah. fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh! Uh... Oh! Ugh. <laughs> the call just dropped out, and <laughs> he's back. Here we go. Yeah, right. that, that was a that was a bad time for the call to drop out. Yeah, and I tried to like pause it. I couldn't pause it. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck. I was like, I'm just gonna play. I'm just gonna play. Fuck the call. I'm just gonna keep playing. I'll, you know what? I'm uh, I'll give it to you regardless of the call drop. James won it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was like, I had to make a decision. I'm like, all right, I'm either calling him back or I'm gonna win. I'm like, I'm gonna win. <laughs> <laughs> that's that. Yeah. That's that's fine. Yeah. I, I think I can handle a loss in Columns 2 on Switch. <laughs> <laughs> what was the most extenuating uh, circumstances you've beaten the game on? Like, you know, if something crazy happens, like you're you're playing like real competitively with some, some, but then somebody spills a beer on you or something like that right at the last second. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I feel like it was probably something when I, when I was a kid. I, I'd get really, like, angry because... Um, you know, if if you're like winning, like somebody else would, uh, you know, pull the cord out or some shit like that. Oh, I guess I that's don't different. Think I've though. ever actually had that happen. I mean, I do know, like the you know, I've had that power outage in Akari Warriors. Oh fuck just you! That, just as I made it to the skeleton guy behind the desk at the end of level three, and you know how long those levels are. It's like one level in Akari Warriors is like an hour and a half. Yeah, that is frustrating when you're like about to do something and then it, it takes it away. It's the name of the game. Yeah. Well, actually, it's called Columns, but. Yeah, it's called Columns, but the real name 
Um, the, the original name that they couldn't use, it was called Fuck the Other Player. Oh, no strategy. I don't know what I'm doing now. <laughs> I was looking for anything, because you don't even have time to think when you're that high up. Oh my god. Also, James and I, you don't like to wear headphones, right? No, I'm not a big fan of headphones because they, they, they make my ears sweat and they itch. Like, I just don't like having something covering my ear all the time. Like, I've never been a big headphone guy. I use them when I have to, but, like, I use them, use them when I'm doing, like, audio editing or something. So if you guys are wondering why we don't do headphones, we don't like them. <laughs> <laughs> we just don't like them. That's all there is that, to that, it. Yeah, exactly. We don't, we don't fucking like them. <laughs> <laughs> that, that, that's really great, too, that we, uh, we advertise headphones in the beginning of like AVGN and stuff. Uh, I love headphones. Which they're great. I mean, like, I've, it's still like for, for people who, yeah, exactly. For people who use headphones, yes, like, you know, but. Right. Us well, so, sometimes I'll use headphones to for like editing, for like checking something. I don't like wearing them for long periods of the time. Like I wouldn't be like streaming for hours with them, but I'll put them on for like a minute if I have to like, like hear something. Exactly, yeah, like it's not bad for like a minute. So, I mean, I use headphones, but just not a lot. Yeah, for a short time, for like a short duration. Yeah, like, that's oh, really know. funny that you're the same exact way. Yeah. Because <laughs> I think most people would be like, what's the problem? Just put the fucking headphones on. And now, and now you guys know why we've been friends for so long. We're not into oh. sports and we don't wear headphones. <laughs> 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 that's, that's, that's where we're similar, I guess. Yeah, yeah. I mean, truthfully, I do like to listen to music on headphones sometimes. It's like great, it's, you know, it's a great way to really enjoy the music, to hear it like really well. But, um, but you know, I don't do it for long periods of time. And if we were doing it now, like, yeah, it would be, it would get, it would get annoying. Because my, my ears really do itch a lot when I wear headphones. And you know what the worst headphones are that I ever had? What's was, that? I don't even know if they make them anymore, but the Apple headphones that would just come with, like, you know, if you buy... Those would always fall out of my ear. Yeah, and the ones that I'm talking about specifically, they weren't even shaped to fit in a human ear. They were like... It was like putting rocks in your ear. They were like these, like, just hard... Like, you know how headphones usually they have, like, something soft, like that little soft part on them? Yeah. These didn't have that. They were just these hard weird like triangular shaped they, they were just like the shape of like small rocks and j you just stuff them in your ear and it like straight up hurts like it's not just uncomfortable it hurts apple was great with back with like os9 <laughs> <laughs> a couple years ago i remember the first time when i used yeah, os9 yeah, i, I know, was like wait. oh my god os9 is the most like user friendly greatest thing and ever since then it's just been downhill with everything. See, I got I got it when OS 10 like just came out. Yeah. So. Actually, um, you know what's really funny? I think when I was using OS 9, I ha I had that old computer. Um, do you remember when we did that Mario Sagali video? And you were yeah. Like, in in that video, you see the computer. I think that I used like OS 9 on. I love OS 9. Speaking of Mario Sagali, like do you know like nobody's ever like interviewed the guy or anything? He passed away. Oh, did he really? And, he, and that's he, not true. He he was he was interviewed a little bit. He just didn't like to talk about it. Oh god. He was, from what I know, he was rich, and he just like he lived his own life. He had his own thing going, and I think he just didn't want to. He just didn't want to be involved. I think is the deal. Mm -hmm. So. I that, mean, you found an inter interview with him though, because I never found anything. There, the, yeah, there there was something at one point that I that I did see, and I think he was just kind of a private person and mostly just wanted I mean, to. That makes sense. Yeah, I was just kind of like um, surprised that n nothing's ever come up. Like no interview, nothing. Like you know. Do you remember that video, by the way? Like that we oh, did yeah. in, in college. I do. Yeah. The following footage of Miyamoto's landlord portrays his bitter hatred for the beloved Nintendo mascot. Miyamoto, you freaking owe me. Um, it's it's funny because um, it's it's like it's like you drinking beer and like flipping off the TV and stuff. It's kind of like a there, there's things in it that have similar characteristics to the to the nerd ABGN. a little bit here and yeah, there. It's, yeah, it's very similar to the nerd like like pre Angry Video Game Nerd. Remember, I actually ate um, the the Zelda cereal. I'm sorry that I made you eat that. No, 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 that's all right. I remember like you know back then you know you're on camera and everything and then you just want to like make it funny like you 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 know so 
Well, it wasn't really Zelda. It was just whatever cereal I had in the, in the yeah, place. Yeah, I think it was the Mario Zelda cereal, the one that had both. And it, I mixed it with... What, what was it like Bacardi or something? And it's real. Like we could have used we could have used water or something. Oh shit! Did we like, did we use real vodka? <laughs> yeah, it was real. Like I it was actually. <laughs> and I remember it was just kind of like sometimes you do that stuff. You're just like fuck it. You know you want you want people to you know laugh at it like, um you know like getting covered in fake shit or something. You, you're like because you know you're it, like it's obviously not comfortable, but at the time when you do it, you're probably just like. You know what, if it's gonna make the video funny. Speaking of fake shit, one of the other things we did, I don't know if like people really saw, but the uh, the the toilet monster thing we did. Yeah, it came from the toilet. So those which was what guess... began the tradition of me covering you in fake shit. Were those the first um, two things we made together? Was was the Mario Sigali thing and then that I guess? Uh yeah, they, they were. I mean it was I I it was probably it came from the toilet. That was because I was looking for somebody. Who I, th I think I think it covered. was. I think the toilet thing was we did first. Yeah, because nobody wanted to get covered in fake shit, except you. You didn't mind. So I mean, you, not that you didn't mind, but you were like, you know, fuck it, I'll do it. So I'll, I don't care. I'll do anything. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know what though? It's been a long time since I've covered you in fake shit. We're gonna have to get on that. That that's yeah. Whenever you want, you call me up. If you <laughs> if you need somebody to dr dress in a monkey suit, I'm ready to go. If you, if you need somebody to, you know, throw a p big pile of shit on, I'm your guy. Yeah. I, you know? I'm talented like that, James. <laughs> I have those skills. If you ever want my qualifications, uh... Yeah. <laughs> that, that's one of the things about... Uh, can I say something about being covered in shit? If you're ever gonna be covered in shit for anything, you have to have somebody else do it, because there has to be the other person who gets to have the satisfaction of pouring shit on the other person, or it's not as fun. Wait, are we done? Because I'm like on autopilot. I'm like still playing, so... I, I, I think we're done. I think we have no Okay, problems. I'm going to put the controller down just to stop myself. Columns uh, 2, it was an arcade game. The original Columns was an arcade game, and then they ported them to Sega. But the thing that's cool here is that this game, Columns 2, was never on the Sega Genesis. Okay, let me reiterate that. So, Columns 1, the original, came out in Genesis, right? Yes. You know what? I have Columns 3. Yeah, so basically they skipped Columns 2 on Genesis? That's what it looks like. Let me read the Columns 3 thing. Columns 3, okay, it was in the arcade. It was on Sega Genesis. Columns 3 uh, is a sequel to this one. Um... I think they just I think they just skipped Collins 2 on 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 Sega Genesis for some reason they they didn't put it on Sega Genesis they but then they put out Collins 3. They skipped Collins 2 on Genesis. So this is a mini, mini chronologically confused here. You, you know what it it could have been worse if they would have called Collins 3 Collins 2 and did all that shit. <laughs> that <laughs> that three, see I'm glad they at least didn't do that. Like hey, we didn't put out Collins 2. Well, the next one, it's just going to be Columns 3. Like, it's like honest. It's like, hey, you know what? We just didn't do that one. Anyway, <laughs> uh, yeah. that was uh, Columns 2 for uh, Switch. It, it's it's actually really good. It's it's fun to play, and you can play it with a friend online. Uh, I, uh, I must have local co-op, so it's definitely a recommend. And even to, like, the old, old school gamers who had Sega Genesis, you know, uh, we all missed out on that one. So I think it's worth the purchase. So Columns 2, really good. Let's go back to the freaking wonder years, you piece of